Yo, hey guys, what's up? And welcome back to Bird of She Road. <laughs> hey guys, what's up? How are you doing? Good? All right, great, awesome. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for joining me once again. Thank you for deciding to spend your Mondays with me. If it's your first time visiting me, welcome, what's up, how you doing? I'm Roberta. So today, what am I going to talk about? I'm going to talk about hair products that I've been using for years and I've been loving for years and new ones that I have incorporated into my hair, hair routine. This is from the hair show, that's Fashion Week. And I tried this main choice, Heavenly Halo. This right here though, it smells like money. Okay, it don't smell like money, but it smells so amazing. Like, guys, it smells like perfume. Like, I need her to put this in the perfume bottle without it being soapy. And I will put this on my body. It smells so amazing. I don't know what she put in here. It is infused with biotin and vitamin D and E oil. Well, vitamin D and E, not oil. And I love using it. It's so moisturizing. When I say it's so moisturizing, like, I love, love, love. Like I haven't touched my Shea Moisture since I've gotten this. That's that says a lot. And it has burdock root too. Oh, we made it. Another thing that I like to use for a pre-shampoo is the it's the Myel Organics Magongo pre-shampoo um, pre-shampoo treatment. I love this. It's great. It melts into my hair. It's super slippery. It tangles my hair like nobody visits my hair. It gets tangled really quick and really easily. And then after I keep it in my hair and I go with the shampoo. It's magic, all right? And then after my shampoos and my cleansers or whatever, or deep detanglers, I go on with the deep conditioner. This, protein's free. So whoever is protein sensitive, this right here. And I used I used to use the Babasu oil one, and I love the Babasu. When I tell when I love the Babasu, I love it. But the Babasu had my hair growing like, I can't stop my left hand, so I'm gonna do this one. It had my hair growing like this, okay? Really, really quick really, really full, but this is so moisturizing that I gravitate to this more because it's so moisturizing. And the little goes a long, long way. Even though it look like a small, it's only eight full ounce, it look like a small bottle. It is a small container, sorry, but a little bit goes a long way. I probably, I most likely, most of the time I get four, three and a half to four washes out of this. And I love, this is the Mongongo Hydrating Condition. And the infamous TGIN Honey Miracle Hair Mask. With raw honey olive, and olive oil. It's done. I got a lot of uses. I'll say I, I got about five or six. People used to talk about it, but I'm just like, yeah, I guess it. Meaning that you guys are hyping it up. This, the Mayo and the Babasu, the Mayo Babasu oil one are the dream team. Like, the dream team. That you would never complain about moisture again if you use these three. It's a lot of money. It don't go on sale like that either. It's a lot of money, but it is amazing. So that's why I haven't repurchased because it's not cheap. Not TGIA, you come on, sis. Like, I, I get it, honey is expensive and olive oil, but I was out. Like, it's not, okay? But it's amazing. Like, it's amazing. And I'm, I'm going to sound like a broken record, but I just keep saying it's amazing. It's great. It's wonderful. Like, it, you know, it really is. I'm not, I'm not, guys, I'm not getting paid for this. I'm not guessing it. This is like, it's amazing, okay? I've been using this for years. I probably went through about 20 of these bottles because I've been using them for what? 2014. That's it. It's great. It's wonderful. Moisturizing. Doesn't. It's not heavy. It's light. It seeps right into your hair strand. It, it, it's, there's no buildup. It keeps like it's. It's perfect. It's great. Thank you, Mayo. You, thank. Thank you for this. I appreciate you. I love it. And another one that I love, and I've been using this for so many years, and I keep repurchasing. Sixteen ounce. They have the eight ounce, but this, like, I got hair strands in it, but that's how real this is. Like, this is my last bottle. It's about, it's about $30 for this big jar. I get it from Sally's. And I think the eight ounce is about $16 or whatever. But this, my hair stay moisturized. I use it as a, as a twisting butter. And sometimes, I, most of the time I use it as a moisturizer. But I can also use it as a twisting butter. This is amazing. I have cocoa butter, shea butter, castor oil, jojoba, jojoba oil, sugar beet root. Like, it's so good. And it's like $32. And I was spent that $32 over and over again. Whenever Sally's have a sale, I hit up my mother. I said, yo, mom, they're doing that sale again. You trying to rack up? She be like, bang. Let me know how much. Like, say no more, sis. 
So I buy like four. Cause you know, I did say it's 32 dollars. I can't really think. You still gotta be a little humble. I like curry refreshers. A lot of people don't use it. Some people don't care for it. Don't really know what's the difference between curry refresher and the leave-in. Curry refreshers, to, to me, my understanding of it is not, it's very light, it's very liquidy. So I use aloe vera juice, like the authentic aloe vera juice I get from Trader Joe's. I use it as a curry refresher. I use it as a leave-in, you know? But like, if I'm gonna get more of a wet look, I will use that, but TGIN sent me a sample of this when I ordered the deep conditioner. This rose water though? Oh, I like this. It's really good. And I need to see if they sell it in the big bottle because I like to get this, put this, incorporate this in my hair routine because this is really, really good. Um, It's light. It doesn't wet my hair so much my, so my hair don't shrink. So it keeps the, um, the length, it keeps the um the shape and it's just a light mist and mist. So look how I miss. But look at this, it's such a pretty mist, like, mm. And if you're naturally been using spray bottles long enough, you will see the pain it is to have a spray bottle that doesn't spray right. It shoots at you and it hurt, like I hate it. Okay, so I love me a container that just shoots like with love and understanding and care, I love it, like, mm. Thank you, TJ, y'all just killing the game, man. I just got lowered the price a little bit, but y'all killing the game though. Uh, thank you. And the other one I like to use is Proclaim. This is like old school, all right? This, I bought this. I got this also from mom, um, the Well Natural Hair Show, whatever, fashion show, whatever. My friend goes to and she usually brings back some, um, a bag full of stuff, which thank you, Edna, you're the best. <laughs> Cause I don't go. But um, this joint right here, I ran through about over 10 bottles of these. They changed the formula from when it first came out. I think so, because it doesn't, it's still good, it's still great, but not as the first one that I was using. But bro, this is amazing. This is good, this is almost out, like I'm almost out of it. And I think, I think it's my last one actually. But this is really good. This is a Jamaican black castor oil, high, castor oil hydrating and reparative curl refresher spray. The spray on this is not that great. See? Oh, 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 so they want to behave because I'm on camera. Okay, whatever. But it's not as great as the TGIM, but I love it. I think this is like well, $5. Works, 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 works. Also from Sally's. Now I'm trying to find the link to the link everything below, but I love it. It's great. A lot of people don't know about it, but the Proclaim Jamaican Black Cast Oil. Try it. Curl Fresher. Amazing. Moisturizer. Can't go wrong. I love it. And this is the Myel Organics Pomade to Oil treatment this is the mogongo oil moisturizing smells amazing after i put in my moisturizer or my leave-in i put a little bit of this in my hair and the other oil i'm gonna show you i put in my scalp i don't put this in my scalp i don't want to i don't know if it's i don't know i don't want to risk clogging my pores or the case maybe so i put in my hair keeps it moisturized like it's great like it's great it's great it's great it's great it's thick not thick in the sense of like it's heavy, but it's thick as it is a pomade, and it, once you rub it in your in your hand and your natural warmth warm it up, it turns into oil. And I've been through. It takes a while to finish too. This is like my third one I've been using for about a year and a half. Not this specific one, but in the last year and a half, it I, I only went through three. So one lasts me about six months. So can't go wrong. Cannot go and catch my own the sale. Great. And if you're in it's not, it's like $12, $13. Yeah. You cannot go. I love this. And then we have, oh, before that, I don't want to add, add another oil that I like from Mayo. It's the new rosemary oil. I honestly think that oil also helped with my hair growth. Because if, for those who know, when I cut my hair like two years ago, short and it was all blonde. And like, baby, you got some <laughs> You got some length out here. You see? Like, and for it to grow this much and this thick from when I cut it, I think the rosemary helped with the hair growth. I, and it claims that it's going to do that, but I really think it did do that. I ran out, I need to repurchase, but I already have oil, so I'm not repurchasing yet. Back to not just gathering stuff and just collecting stuff. I actually wanna, in the practice of just finishing stuff and then repurchasing when it's done. So it's not a whole bunch of just hoarding stuff. Cause I used to do the back, back in the day, like four years ago. And I just, I stopped doing that. So until I'm done, at least with one of these, because I bought two of these, 
I'm gonna get that again. But I really like this too. So this one is the Bloom Super Potent Healthy Hair. This is wrong. This is a Sultanical Bloom Super Potent Healthy Hair Growth Oil with organic herbs, herbs, vitamins, and botanicals. I keep wanting to say herbs. I'm not gonna have that argument with y'all. But I love this. I use this in my scalp. And I told you the combination of, um, I've been using this throughout this week. If my hair's feeling a little dry because the weather is really cold, I will use a little bit of this and a little bit of that in my hair and that moisturizes it and I keep it going. This, I got this during the Black Friday sales, 40% off and I, I never tried Sultanical, so this is my first time trying this stuff and so far, I this is like one of my favorite products of all the things that I bought because I haven't tried everything yet, but I'm really loving this. It's like, it's light, it's not heavy. It seeps right into my hair strands. It doesn't sit on top of my hair. I'm high porosity because you know, so sometimes things can just sit on top of your hair, but I, I, well, when I say hair, I mean hair strands and I like Sultanical so far with this, you know. Uh, I love it and it has some like no that's what doesn't have herbs but I bought two of these and it's good it's good I, I have nothing negative to say about this it's really good it smells good um, it goes right into it I love it I have nothing bad to say but so far this two combo they're killing the game and when it comes to stylus guys this right here this is this twist this is why I used to do this twist and one week old and I still got some definition. I, it's 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 great. It's great. It smells amazing. I've been using this for years. It never fails me. It keeps my hair moisturized. It keeps my twist defined. It doesn't shrink my hair. I like this too because it's not like how a cream is. Sometimes it can your hair will shrink. But guys, like this is amazing. I get this from Sephora during this sale, and which is I think it's coming up in April. I hope I have money for it. But during the sale, I rack up. I usually would just buy one and would last me till the next sale. So this, the last time I got this was the last April sale. So I would say like this lasts me for about a year. If this is the only product you're using, if this is the only product you're using, it's not gonna last you that long, but I use other products too. So it has olive oil, oil and mango butter oil. One thing about my hair, my hair loves mango butter. It loves mango butter. Mango butter defines my hair so well. So I know that that is part of the reason why it, my twist out lasts for that long, or my twist out stayed that defined for that long. But the Commit Biologics Ethiopic Hydra Twist Butter, I will forever buy this over and over and over again. I get. I want to try some of the other stuff too, but so far, this is something that I have re, been repurchasing since I've been natural for what seven years. I went natural in 2012. And I've been using this since like 2013, 2014. Like, this is old school. A lot of people don't know about it, but and she don't get the credit she deserves. But this is old school. This is great, and I'll forever love this. And I'll forever keep purchasing. Please don't discontinue this because a lot of people don't know about it. But I'm putting you on. It's amazing. Okay, and she have other products. So try it. The last but not least, another twist out butter that I love. I've been using for years and years and years. It's the As I Am Twist Defining Cream. As well off as all the labels are off. This is probably like my fourth jar. And um moisturizing, great twist out, lasting twist out. It's not as expensive as a double buttercream. It has sunflower oil, castor oil, amla oil, apatonic amla, sugar beet root, and last word I can't pronounce, but I love it. I get it from Sally's as well. I've been using this for so long. And the last one. Long time, I've had this for about over six months, you know, it's a big jar too. So a little goes a long way. You don't have to OD like sometimes, and I'm heavy handed. But um, yeah, so that's that. This is my hair process I've been using that I thoroughly love, you know, like I love it. I always go back to it. That's like my main, my main, whatever I just mentioned are my main hair products I always go to that I will forever go to. Um, it's, it's just, they do right by me. And the only new ones that I've added to my hair product collection or my hair product routine is the, um, the Sultanicals, like I mentioned, the TGIN, the, both the deep conditioner, the hair refresher, and the um, the main choice shampoo. Like, but everything else, that's what I use. And this is my current routine. I have some other stuff, but this is my go-to. And I hope it works well for you as well. 
And um, yeah. So thank you for watching and I will catch you next time. Once again, do not forget to subscribe and do not forget to hit the bell button. And do not forget to not to follow me on Instagram. Because I do a lot of stories talking about stuff that I'm trying. Because I just like sharing information. So if you want, check check me out on Instagram as well. And so you can be updated on my daily whatever. So yeah, thank you.